So our next guests are two of the country's leading manufacturers reps, uh, a couple of real uh, seasoned uh, gentlemen here, uh, Murray Percival from the Murray Percival Group, uh, welcome to the show. Thank you for having us. And of course uh, Don Dennison who has won five uh, best in class uh, awards this week from your suppliers. Yep. Uh, so we're in the presence of royalty here, I think. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. So let me start out. I mean, you guys have been in this business a long time. When, when, did, when did you get into it? Uh, I started in 81. 81? I started working with Heller Industries, where okay. I met Murray and his dad. Yeah. Yep. yeah. So you both worked at Heller Industries? No, Murray was our rep. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. I was working at Heller. Yeah. Yeah. So you were probably at that time working for your dad because I you're, was. You're, you're second generation. Yes, I, I was. And yeah. For me, it's been 46 years this year mm -hmm. right. uh, with the company. And uh, that's a long time, eh? Isn't it? Uh, a long time. Yeah. And your dad, your dad started the, 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 the company in 19... Yeah, 1960. Started the company and uh, we've been with Electrovert for 58 years. Right. We're selling waste out of machines and right. Heller was our big oven. Right. right. And yeah, uh, right. awesome okay. people. Yep. Yeah. So... Um, you know, the manufacturer's reps is, 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 is um, it's very unique here to the United States. Outside of the United States, it's usually distributors mm -hmm. that, that sell. Why do you think that is? I mean, and what are the strengths that a manufacturer's rep brings to the party? Mm -hmm. Well, I think focus, right, Don? Yeah. I mean, I mean we, we, we focus uh, a lot on what we're doing. Yeah, we're, we're the, uh, the guys between the factory and and the and the customers, and we have to know all the technical information and be prepared to be the front line when machines go in and right. machines be uh, processed. And mm -hmm. yeah, customer wants to know everything that they can before they buy a machine. So. Right. So they're, they're they're happy to have a local point of sales yep. person that they can deal with a go-to guy who knows the industry, who knows all the the, the different options out there. Uh, and will help to look after their interests. Yeah, I think I think we're the relationship builders, right? So mm -hmm. we get to focus on relationships, and that's what it's all about, right? Right. I mean, a lot of this equipment today is a lot of the same stuff, right? And, mm -hmm. you know, there's some differences, but uh, I think we own the relationships, and that's what we build, and not being a distributor, you know, for the equipment. We could focus on just the relationship and right. let our principals, you know, worry about everything else to fulfill mm -hmm. the orders, right? Mm -hmm. But uh, it's all about relationships, people. And what, what about, what about um, you know, the, I mean, the industry is, is changing, though. Uh, the, the equipment's getting a lot more sophisticated. Mm. It's a lot more software-driven. Mm -hmm. um, you guys have to understand how that works. Uh, and you go, I know you go to countless training ses, uh, sessions with sure. your principals. Sure. Um, how, you know, how do you see the, the, the industry evolving technically? It's, you, know, you have to keep up to speed with everything as it changes. Um, they're always looking for something faster, better, mm -hmm. uh, more accurate, um, and, and they're looking for the support. Um, so they don't want to miss out on something and get falling behind. So mm -hmm. uh, our, our principals are, are good about holding the training and keeping right. us up to speed. Yeah. Yeah. I think, Trevor, I think we, we really, um, you know, we used to know everything about all these machines. We could even install them and set them up back in the days, but those days are gone, right? It's far too technical, as you've, you've said. So it's really about, you know, just marrying up the, these customers and prospects with the right people and making sure we understand what the real issue is because it's not always what you think it is, right? Mm -hmm. So really understanding the real issue and then marrying those folks up with the right principles and let them do the technical side of things, right? I mean, yeah. we got to rely really heavy on them today, more than we ever have, I think. Sure, they, uh, they rely on us to put them in char in touch with the right people at, at the manufacturer right. so that they can get an answer quickly. So. Right. Well, I mean, here's one of the things I have with, with uh, the U.S. at the moment, and that is that a lot of the manufacturers here, the smaller ones, are not really taking on board the digitization and autom automation that they need to be. Uh, looking at because the bigger boys are racing ahead of them they're opening up bigger margins and these guys these smaller guys are going to end up going out of business now is it partly your job to 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 wake these guys up and say look you know you need to be thinking about this well sure um, you know our customers when they need an answer on something they need it right away so right. whether that be a zoom meeting or um, having someone get on the phone 24/7 they, they demand that now 
mm-hmm. and uh, that's been a challenge. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. I, I think also we're, you know, I look at us as, as solution providers, right? I mean, we love to sell gear and help. We want to help people, but. You know, there's a lot of things that our customers, you know, need help on in improving their processes, right, and bringing solutions to them, right? I mean, they're they're going to buy and and choose what they choose, and you know, educated enough, they'll do that. But we 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 just got to help them and look for ways to help them improve their process that they might not even be looking at. And, and so, so does your 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 help go beyond just the the equipment side? I mean, for example, a lot of people are having. Labor shortages that mm. can't find operators. Oh, yeah. Do you help? Do you help uh, any of your your customers with that? Oh, absolutely. Um, mm. You know, we we sometimes have to be the psychiatrist for the customer. And <laughs> help! Uh, you you know, I lost an operator, and oh yeah. my gosh, I get I get those five o'clock phone calls every day, and yeah. how troubling a day it was, uh-huh. and you know how many fires they put out. But yeah, you know, it. it's that that's the relationship part of it. That yeah. you so do you, you do family therapy as well, then? <laughs> oh. Most of sometimes. the time, sometimes, <laughs> yeah. yeah, sometimes. Yeah, I mean, it's it's uh, you know there you know there's also a lot of folks are retiring, right? So there's yeah. a lot of these, you know, new 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 kids in the I call them kids, right? I guess we yeah. can do that at our young age, but the you know these these new kids and, and we want to help them out, right? And because they're the future of this industry, yeah, right. So you know, really really pulling them under our wings and helping to educate them and you know bringing in technical support, advanced product people to help them to improve their processes and help them get educated on yeah. the processes because we've got a long ways to go. Yeah, absolutely. It's every day, right? Yeah. And, and they really appreciate when you do that for them. You know, they don't forget that. That's good. That's good. Well, it's an important function as well because, it, you know, the, the, the transfer of knowledge is not there the way it used to be. Mm. Uh, so they're relying on people like yourselves to, to be able yeah. to help out there. So there you go. Yeah. Anyway, guys, it's great to catch up. Yep. You're both doing a great Thanks. job, and yep. congratulations on your yep. multiple wins again, Don. Yep. Well done. Uh, if and you want me to share some of those wins with me, I'd be more than happy to help <laughs> you out, carry the awards around or cash the checks. But Well done. Yeah, Trevor, thanks a lot. We, yeah, we thank you both appreciate, we appreciate uh, what you do for the industry, so thank yep. you very much. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.